Hey friends, Gator Mom here. I hope you're having an awesome day. Welcome back to my channel. Today I'm sharing with you a review and packing video on the 31 Casual Cargo Tote. This print is called Twill Stripe. All right, so this bag I have tried in the past from 31, and I was excited to try it again. It was years ago that I've had this bag. I'm talking maybe, I don't know, five years ago or something like that, but I decided to go ahead and repurchase this bag. One, because it was on special for the month of June. So if you all are watching this video and it's the last couple days of June, you could still get this bag on special. It is half off if you spend $35. So that's how I purchased it. So one, it was a great deal. Two, I absolutely am obsessed with the stripes. And three, I wanted to try out the bag again because there's a couple of new features inside this bag that it did not have before in years past when I had it. I am pleasantly surprised. It is so so crazy comfortable to carry. You have these awesome tote straps that are just really soft. They don't slip off your shoulders. It's like an easy breezy like summer type bag. You can really throw and go. Um, it would make an awesome travel bag, an awesome baby bag, or just an awesome everyday bag. You also have the optional um, long strap here and it's really long. So all of you that are really tall out there, this um, bag would be comfortable on you and you wouldn't have any issues with the straps. I am short, so when I wear it crossbody, even on the lowest um, length here, it goes down pretty far like on my hip. So it's still comfortable to me, but you have so much room if you are taller out there. So just something to note. This bag you can also get embroidered. The embroidery would be right here on the center. I chose not to get it embroidered just because I'm not a huge fan of embroidery on the outside of my bags. I do love to embroider pouches and lunch boxes for the kids, home organizing stuff and all of that. But as far as bags, just not like a huge fan. But if you like that, you can definitely have the option to do that on here. So on the front of the bag, I'll just kind of go around the outside like I always do. I'm going to take off the messenger strap just because I don't want it flopping around the entire time. But on the front of the bag here, you have two great little pockets um, for just kind of things that you need to grab for quickly. Over here in this one, I have my sunglasses. I have two pens and I just have a thing of gum. In the other pocket next to it, I just have a um, hand sanitizer by Honest Company. Um, a little uh, chapstick from Perfectly Posh, and then I also have a hand cream and a lip gloss. So these are like my go-to items that I need all the time. So it's a great little pocket for them. And then I think I had like a hair tie. Oh, yep, yeah, I still have a hair tie in there. So that's everything in these two little pockets here. On the back of the bag, you have one little pocket, which is awesome because I love that it's kind of lined in this brown like faux leather, but it is perfect for your cell phone. I have an iPhone X or 10 or whatever it's called, I'm not sure, but it's the regular one, it's not the plus size, but it mine goes in here really easily, so I do think you guys with plus size phones would be fine with this pocket, but I'm not 100% of course since I don't have one. But it's not felt lined or anything like that, but it is lined with a really soft material, so um, it won't like scratch your phone or anything like that. So that's what I have in that back pocket. I love that it's just one little pocket and I know what's in it, like it's like the perfect cell phone size. So so that's what's back here on this on in the back of the bag. Over here on the side of the bag, you don't have any pockets or anything, but I did want to show you how you can actually snap the sides of this bag closed and it kind of adds a little bit of a different silhouette of the bag. Very similar to the Lily Jade Shaley. Those of you that might um, have seen that bag or have that bag, that's like an all leather bag, but it reminds me of that because it snaps down here on the sides. Then when you need more room, you can unsnap it or if you want to carry it like crossbody or something like that, you can unsnap it here. I love again the detail of this like brown kind of leather here on the sides. I just think that it's really nice against the um, cream and navy striped. So that's everything as far as the outside of the bag goes. Now I'm gonna get on into the inside. Over here hanging out, I just have it hanging out of the zipper pocket. It's not attached to the bag or anything. I have my keys and the um, bracelet strap that you can purchase from 31 and a packed party keychain. Um, I just kind of like them hanging out there. They're easy to grab. I'll sometimes just throw them here on the inside of my bag, but they're just like that for now. Um, 
Attached to these is my wallet. So there's so many times that I will just grab this and go if I'm popping into the store or when I went to the movies with the kids or things like that and I just don't need like a big bag at that particular moment. So I love the way that the strap and this little keychain kind of complement the navy. This wallet here is the All About the Benjamins wallet. Um, it's another 31 product that I recently got. And what I love about it is you can open it up and it becomes nice and flat. You have a spot over here for all your cards. Then you have additional room over here for more cards, a zipper pocket, and a place for either your phone or receipts. I think that it's a great setup as far as a wallet goes. I shared it kind of in detail over on my Insta stories if you guys wanna check that out, but this is a full size wallet. They have tons and tons of colors in this and it's a great buy. So I have that just sitting up vertically on the inside of the bag. Then I also have sitting inside here the um, little, I think it's called the mini pouch. It's the smaller pouch of the two that 31 have. And this is of course in the twill stripe pattern to match. I have all of my things in here. So all of my like cosmetic type items. I also have a little notepad. I was charting my son's medicine when he was ill with a bad ear infection. Um, I just have like travel deodorant. I have my pill case. Um, more hand sanitizer, some lip products. You guys get the gifs. It's just kind of like all of my type stuff in this small little cosmetic bag. Then right next to it, I had a thing of children's Motrin because I was needing to give that to my son. The next item I have in here is the small thermal zipper pouch. I'm not sure how many of these they still have left in stock. This was an item that was earlier in the summertime for 31, but I love it. If they have any left in stock, you should definitely grab one. I saw like a flamingo one, I believe last time I checked that they still had, but on the inside here, it's completely thermal. And what's great is it's like the perfect little size for like a med kit on the go, which is what I'm using it for. I have like my tissues in here, some baggies, travel um, tweezers and um, scissors. I also have all of our skin sticks in here so they won't melt in the car as easily. I have a perk one here. This is like for peppermint, for motion sickness and headaches. I have our healer stick, which we absolutely don't ever leave home without. That's like an all purpose like skin type stick. And then of course, summertime, I have our face sunblock in here. Those are some of like the skin sticks I have in there. And then in addition to that, um, on the inside, of course, you have band-aids and some um, cream, itch cream, all that kind of stuff. You can really fit a lot in this pouch and I think it's perfect that it's thermal um, because it's Florida and I don't want these things to melt. So that's what I have in there. Then right here next to it, I have my weekly simplified planner. I am so excited to start using the new one in just a couple weeks, but I have that in there. And then I also have just some catalogs I was looking at. And then right behind it, I have um, three file folders for one for each of my kids, just cause we've been in and out of the dentist and the doctor and summer camps and all of that kind of stuff. So it was just easier for me to put everything in a folder to remember that I need to drop off forms at school and all these different places. So I have one for each of them just tucked down in here so that'll give you a good size as to what would fit inside this bag. So if you wanna use it for like a work bag or a bag coming to and from home, like going popping up to Starbucks or whatever, you could definitely put your laptop and folders and planners and all that kind of stuff in there. Then I have also a large zipper pouch. I love this print from 31. It's like garden something, I forget the name of it. But inside here, I have all of our on the go toys. So I have coloring books in there, I have crayons, I have a little like mastermind game that my oldest likes to play. I have a puzzle, I have cars and Lego men and PJ masks. I mean, there's still so much more room in here than um, what I have packed in here, but this bag here would be perfect for changes of clothes for multiple kids, for diapers and wipes, for toys like I have it, for snacks. I mean, you can use this one for anything. So I have this one and then I have another one on the way that I ordered because I just can't have too many of them. They're just really the perfect size. So I have that in there. That is everything I have in the main kind of bulk of the bag here. Then you have two elastic pockets on the side. This one over here, I just have some wet ones tucked away. And then I also have a tissue, um, what else, that's it. I had some pens, yes, I have a pen down in there. I had a couple more, but the kids used them when we were out. And then over here in this side elastic pocket, 
I have a, um, another 31 pouch that I've been really loving. So I only got one of these because I wanted to make sure I liked the quality and everything, but they have a large clear cylinder one and a large like rectangle one. But this is our on the go travel Jenga that we like to play. It's perfect for like waiting for food at a restaurant and things like that. Um, we got them at the dollar store, but you can also fit things like toys and cars and pencils and crayons, you name it. It really fits a ton and it opens up nice and wide so you can get whatever it is that you want to play with and then you can zip it up um, perfectly whenever you're done so I just think it's the greatest little pouch for inside a diaper bag you can put like you can even put medical needs in there like if you have like diaper rash cream or all of your med type stuff um, on the go teething essentials for baby I mean the list goes on and on you could fit a ton in that so that's everything inside the bag now I want to show you the main reason I purchased this bag and the reason I wanted to try it out again this back zipper pocket goes the entire width of the bag and it is thermal lined so I'm obsessed with a thermal pocket inside a bag, especially when it's this comfortable. So inside here, I have an endless amount of snacks. I have granola bars for days, since that seems to be our go-to when we're out. I also have a ton of these go squeezes. This pocket, you can really hold a lot, a lot of snacks. You can also fit like sandwiches in here. You could do sippy cups, you could do bottles. Um, you can really fit a lot inside this back pocket. So I love that feature about this bag. So that is my review on this casual cargo tote. If you guys have any questions, I will have the link below um, to this one, but you guys know where to find me. Shoot me a message, shoot me an email, um, or what have you, and I would be happy to help you out if you have any additional questions. Hope you have an awesome day.